I made this cute little pouch for my smartphone and I'm going to show you how I did it. I did it using four needles. You're going to want to use a nice sturdy yarn for this, something that won't fall apart. I used a polished cotton. I cast on 20 stitches and now this is going to be the hardest part. I'm going to do the stitches and I'm going to separate them onto all the needles. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and then I'm ready for the next needle. I'm going to do the same thing on the second needle, knit six stitches. Now the last needle, I'm going to knit off all the stitches, and there's going to be eight left. Now I have all the stitches on the needle. Make sure that all the stitches are facing toward the center and now I'm going to join it. Again, this is the hardest part. I'm going to put the last needle into the first stitch and bring the thread from the last stitch. Make sure you don't twist it. And there you have it. And now I'm going to start ribbing. Knit two, purl two. Get those all off the needle and then go on to the next needle. I've ended with knit two. Going to push the needles forward. And now I'm ready to purl two. Like I said, this is going to be the hardest part. Purl two, knit two, and purl two. And then ready for the next needle to start with knit two because I've ended with purl. And just continue in the ribbing until you get to the end of that last. Now continue on. Don't worry that there's this space there. That's going to go away. And just knit two. Now at this point you're going to want to put a marker so that you'll know that that's the beginning of the row. And continue with knit two, purl two, and just do that for a couple of rows just so that at the top, which this is, there will be the ribbing which will make it come in and then we're just going to switch to regular knitting. 